What is up guys, my name is Mark Wagner and today I'm going to be telling you about three huge niches that you can make a killing in. Not only that, but I'm going to be showing you how to choose the niche that's right for you. First off, let's talk about what I consider the three main niches of dropshipping. These are health slash beauty, fashion, and gadgets. Gadgets are things like hoverboards or fidget spinners, stuff that doesn't really fit into a specific category. If you do want to sell in one of these niches, I recommend you get a little bit more specific because they're just so big. I mean, these are multi-billion dollar industries. Let's talk about how you can really focus in on what you want to sell. The first thing that you should understand is it works best if you're passionate and knowledgeable about the niche. It doesn't have to be your favorite thing, but as long as you're familiar with it, it's going to make it a lot easier and a lot more fun. However, it doesn't always work so well. Most niches aren't going to work good with dropshipping, but that's where you should start your research. See if there's any successful dropshipping stores in that niche. The second thing that you need to understand is that your niche needs to have a good balance. It needs to be balanced between being way too big of a market and being way too small of a market. It also needs to be balanced between having a ton of competition, overly saturated, all that, and being the only dropshipping store in it. If you can't find a single dropshipping store in a certain niche, chances are that it just doesn't work. The third thing that you need to understand is that products and trends are going to be your bread and butter. You really have to keep up with the marketing and constantly test products that you think are hot that are in niches that you'd sell in. But how do you sell products if you haven't picked a niche yet? Make a general store and then choose two to four niches that you think are selling well for other people. Just make these as separate collections. Then. Add a bunch of products that other people are selling successfully in those niches. Focus all your social media, all your attention on one specific niche and then change every couple of weeks. The goal is to test as many niche products as possible and really just get your foot in the door. Eventually you're going to find a niche that sells really well, has really good influencers and everything sort of lines up and that's your niche. I really hope you enjoyed this video and I was able to help you with one of the hardest parts of starting a Shopify dropshipping store. Just do your research and don't rush it. If you haven't started your Shopify journey yet, feel free to start your free two week trial by using the link in the description of this video. You guys have an awesome day and I'll see you in the next one.